Hola. I'm Kim Elizabeth, and we are here, and we are at the White Rabbit Coffee House, and I'm enjoying a visit getting to know Amber, Amber and Carla. Carla. Mm -hmm. And they are with It's Strictly Business, cleaning and they're a cleaning service. They clean homes, residential businesses, and they're gonna tell us a little bit about their business so that you can get to know them and know why you should hire them, right? Yes, absolutely. Okay. Tell me when you started this business and why. I opened it three months ago. Um, I decided to open my own business because um, I wanted to work for myself. Um, I didn't want a boss above me and um, I like doing what I do and that's what started this. And we opened about three months ago and we serve all of Texoma, even Oklahoma. We also have Bonham, Paris, anywhere in the local area we can we can get to you so if i was gonna say like how many hours out would you consider harris is like an hour right yes okay. i would say probably two hours yeah yeah okay i know several cleaning services especially when they're starting yeah that's what they do they'll go out and then as they get busier you know Start rain it back in, in. yes yeah, back in. <laughs> okay so when you go to clean, do you take your own equipment? Do people have to provide the cleaning supplies? How does that work? So we do take our own supplies. Um, we have everything that we will need. Um, we sometimes use the client stuff. It just kind of depends if they want us to use their stuff. Like a certain product. Exactly. Or, or their own vacuum. Some clients don't okay. want, you know, my vacuum in their house. They right. want to use their own vacuum. Right. So we, we just kind of you know go back and forth with them and see what they want but if they don't have anything we will provide it you provide it yes ma'am i have a really cool cleaning story to tell you uh oh i can make it short <laughs> i can make it short okay so i had this house cleaner they were new their husband got laid off they were cleaning together and the first time i come home and my house smelled amazing like it didn't smell like a cleaner i wasn't sure what it was it smelled i don't know fruity or something flowery <laughs> So I called her and I said, what did you clean with? Mm -hmm. And she said, oh, I have this lady and she never has cleaning supplies. And, and uh, so we went to her house to clean. She said she was getting cleaning supplies, but she didn't. And we, were drive we drove out into the country. Oh. So she said we didn't have anything. She had Tide. So we cleaned her whole house with Tide and she loved it. It smelled so good. <laughs> Okay, do you know what Tide does when you put it on your floors and your walls? Yes. <laughs> oh my goodness, it got so sticky. Yes, <laughs> I can only imagine that mess. So I always ask if I have a cleaner, I always say, you know, are you bringing your things? Do you use my things? <laughs> now see, I will say we also do make sure our clients, there's certain things they may have allergies to. Okay. We yes. always discuss our cleaning mm -hmm. products with them before okay. we go in. Yes, and we'll make always. sure that they're not allergic or any smells Anything, don't bother right. them mm -hmm. or you know any of that yes. so is there a cleaning product you typically use or that you like to I love mop and glow I'm just gonna say that yeah. for my floors <laughs> <clears throat> because it smells fantastic it does. and it's I love it but um, we I'm go back my lemon yes okay. <laughs> so we kind of go back and forth with that okay okay <laughs> so tell me um, do you clean together always? Do, not always. Okay. Um, with her having a full-time job, um, oh, I, right. okay. I do. When she's just working, I will be the one cleaning. Okay. Um, so, but so when she is off, yeah, our we deep cleans we usually do together. Right? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Yes. okay. Yes. And so you'll do move-in cleaning, move-out cleaning. Yes. Weekly cleaning. Bi-weekly. Weekly, bi-weekly, monthly. We also do monthly. Um, we'll do Airbnbs. Oh, that's, um, that's yes. a good one because yes. people tell me I'm going to put my home in for Airbnb. Mm -hmm. Do you have a cleaning oh, service? Oh, excellent. Yes. You know, and yes. so, um, you know, there's some names I can give them, but a lot of times those people are chock booked up. Mm -hmm. So, yes. Yes. So now I have a new set of names. Yay. <laughs> yes. But yeah, we'll do pretty much anything. I mean, we. And we like to quote by the job because you know okay. we talked about that the other day. It's just a little hard for us to. So, to are you on any of those services like Angie's or Thumb Thumbtack? 
from whatever it no. is where people contact you and then you have to pay for that service? No. No, okay. We're not at not the moment, yet. like I said, we're just getting okay. started. We're well, trying to figure I it mean, out. I mean, some people getting started are on those. <laughs> yes. Um, but then they tell me on the back end, they have to pay, oh, you know, to um, be on, to be on it yeah. for each lead they get, they have to pay or something like that. I don't know how it works. Yes. But, no, we're not on. So that. they don't stay on long. They try mm -hmm. to use it as a kickstart. I just wondered because then you know people know. Oh, I can find you if I go to one of those services. Yes. So what's the? Are you? You have a website? We don't have a website okay. at the moment. We do have a Facebook page, and it's strictly okay. business cleaning services. Okay. Um, and you can find us on there, and we have business cards. We can give you our number too on here. We'll so. have it going right across okay, the screen. Okay, excellent. Yay. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> but that's where you can find us. Is on Facebook. Okay. For the moment. <laughs> right. Just the FYI, Canva, I don't know if you're familiar with Canva. I am, yes. They have web pages now. Oh nice. I'm so, check that out. Yeah, I don't I don't use them. I mean I use Canva. I have never done their web page thing, but someone told me that they were using them for that. Oh okay. and that it was real easy click click click. I'll yeah. have to check that out then. Yeah, yeah cause Canva <laughs> yeah. that's cool. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can use Canva for all your everything, yes. Well, um, so, and you do have some companies where you go and, do you, are you just responsible for like cleaning at the end of the day or? We actually go in in the mornings. Um, okay. We have Hope Concrete. Uh, that was one of our first clients, so thank you for that. And um, we go in there on Monday mornings while they're there and we just do our thing and. Empty trash and every, everything. Empty Sweet trash, and everything. And everything. The bathroom, yes. And all that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. The hallways. Okay. Everything. And it usually Clean. takes us about three hours. Now on the first clean, I will say that will be the one that takes us the longest. Oh yeah. Because we're we're very particular. And getting to know yes. everything. And, yeah. <laughs> I used to, when I was in high school, I worked for a vet, and about once a month, they had one of us high schoolers um, come in and use this big machine to like they had the you know concrete floors. Uh -huh. We had to clean the floors and. You know, here I was like 85 pounds. I'm like, oh. So it's working you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> but, um, and empty the trash and yes. all that kind of stuff. Um, just, you know, not, they didn't need the floors in all the time, but mm -hmm. um, that was kind of fun. Yeah. But it was at night and by myself. And so sometimes it was a little spooky. Oh, yeah. Especially um, when you're by yourself. Yeah. Mm -hmm. As a teenager, yeah. I would try and bring a friend if I could, usually. <laughs> <laughs> to keep me company, you know. Mm -hmm. Usually, probably not. Probably was frowned on if they knew, but right. but um, I was, you oh, know, well. you know, I'm in a business all by myself. So. Right. What else would you like to tell everybody about your business? What did you do before? Let's talk about you guys. <laughs> what did you do before? Before I started my own business, I worked on a marina. Um, I cleaned boats and condos and slips. Uh, before that, I worked for another cleaning company, and um, I've done a little bit of everything throughout my life, from Bell and Hay to this now, so right. I'm just trying to find my spot. <laughs> well, I mean, but you have good experience with cleaning. I have cleaning. good experience, yes. Yeah, I can imagine boats would take a little bit. They would. They're very <laughs> detailed, absolutely, yeah. yes, and I just kind of carried that with me, you know, over the years, and uh -huh. <clears throat> here you, we are. Do you have families? Yes. yes, I have a husband and I have three kids. Oh, wow. Yes, <laughs> yes. And I have she, two. Mm -hmm. I have two teenagers almost out of the house. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah. so. Mine's not even close to being out. <laughs> right? Yeah. So, I mean, all of us, if we are, even if we live by ourselves, we have some experience cleaning, right? Oh, yeah. Um, it's part of loss. Right. Mm -hmm. But when you do it for a business, then you have to, you know, have an eye for detail you know, like the window sills and behind the doors and you know all yeah. that yes and we're very meticulous too, yes both of us and that is something that we can say about our business is we have a good eye for detail and we go from top to bottom we're not going to leave anything untouched no. <laughs> so people could someone could call you and say hey i just need you to that's vacuum mop mm -hmm. You know, and maybe wipe down the bathrooms or whatever. Right. And and that would be okay. Right? Oh yes, absolutely. Or they could say, I don't like to clean 
you know, yes. I need you to come and do everything. Right, yes, or if they have, you know, a family member that's a hoarder or, you know, maybe they are themselves, yeah. we will do that job. You know, it will take say, us longer, but we'll, we'll get it done. Some people, they want a house cleaner, but there's so much stuff that needs organized. Yes. So are you guys, you're good at organizing yes, too? Yes, we will go through that. We actually have a job coming up that's in Durant that's gonna take us two years. Yes. Um, and it's two houses that we are going to consolidate into one. And wow. from what I understand, it's it's gonna be a, a great transformation. They have put their trust in us. Yes. And we're excited. Yeah. Exciting. Yes, we're excited and that's about a that. a real need. Like, I, of course, cleaning is a need. It, it mm -hmm. will never go away. But, you know, sometimes I have um, elderly clients yes. that they just can't manage. And so there's, like, a room that you can't even, you open the door and it's like, well, the floor to ceiling, wall to wall, full of all the important stuff that right. they don't know what to do with, mm -hmm. or their closets <clears throat> they can't manage, you know, they're like, oh, I have clothes in here from 30 years ago, right. you yes. know, and, and they just, it's too much for them to manage doing all of that. Absolutely, yeah, and that's what we're here okay. for. Yeah. wow, <laughs> I might even see that more often than cleaning needs. Yes, Because a lot of times people say, oh, we'll get it clean, my family will come and help me clean, or yes. whatever. But and our elders are kind of a soft spot yeah. for I me know. too, so I, <laughs> so I would love to do that. Too. Yes, it's not just we're here to clean your house; like we're here to help you. Yes, uh -huh. it, absolutely. Mm -hmm. No matter your age, or, yeah, we're there. Yeah, you know what? I just realized I forgot to turn the light on. I hope it it looks okay though, doesn't it? I think we're all right. Okay. <laughs> all these windows. I know. Yeah, we've got a lot of light. It is. That's what I noticed. I thought, oh, the wind's picking up. We've had a lot of storms lately. Yes. yes. So, do y'all just <laughs> clean inside? Do you do outside work too? We haven't done any outside work, like as far as our business goes. I don't think we will kick that completely out, but I think it'd be something that we could discuss, yeah. depending on what it is, like outside windows, um, window ledges, and uh -huh. stuff like and that. Porches. Yes, we do. Oh, okay. <coughs> okay. And that's, yeah. I was going to say, yeah, sometimes I have clients that need power washing. Yes, and yeah. we have that. We so we're okay. just talk to us. Okay. I mean, we can figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> and sometimes we just need an area clean. Like, you know, they'll have an outdoor living area that's mm -hmm. gotten dusty, cobwebby leaves, yeah. you know, needs power washed. Because a little sprucing up and it will look inviting. You know, it'll maybe a couple amazing. plants. Yes. You know, it'll look so yeah. amazing that the people driveway, will. Yeah. Oh, the no, driveways one too. Difference. It does. Sidewalks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's. I've seen some that. I didn't really think a lot about it till they bought it. Yeah. And then they tell me, oh, I power washed the driveway, and they send me a picture <laughs> where I yeah. go see it, and I'm like. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. It <laughs> is. Yes. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Yes, for sure. Wow, that's so exciting. <laughs> okay, so it's called Strictly Business, mm -hmm. and you're a cleaning business, mm -hmm. and so we can find you on Facebook. You can. Well, um, I've, you're going to have your phone number uh -huh. going across the screen. Do you have? Will you respond to email too? Or? We do. Yes. Okay. Also so, respond to email. Okay. We'll make sure you have an email, <laughs> phone number, Facebook page, all that stuff. Yeah. Um, we talked about. We haven't talked about rates, but you said that's based on the job. Mm -hmm. So, like, if I called you and said, "Oh, I have a three thousand square foot house," you would be like, "When can I see it?" Yes. Right. Yes. Okay. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. I would definitely. I love to quote uh, quote my jobs by the job. Okay. Just because you just never know what you're getting into, you okay, know. So true. it's hard with a cleaning service to have a flat rate, you know. Because yeah. some places may be a little more tidy than other places, you and, know. You know, I've worked in, the, of course, houses that were terrible, um, but like showings and mm -hmm. stuff. But, um, you know, sometimes I'll think, oh, this house isn't too bad. It actually looks good after yeah. they get all moved out. But then when you really start to look, you know, all like the shelving and the cabinets have <laughs> you know how it where you touch the cabinets yes. and the windows all around are dirty the wall. and all of the <laughs> window sills and yeah all around the baseboards yes. and the cobwebs in the ceiling fan yeah. so it's like oh it really isn't as clean as it looked no um, and and that happens at my house too so <laughs> <laughs> it know. happens with us all <laughs> i cleaned the bathroom yesterday and 
and I would have sworn it looked pretty good until I got <laughs> cleaning it. And I was like, oh, we'll just let her do that. <laughs> <laughs> that always <laughs> happens. <laughs> you get in there and get to doing it. It's like, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I'm so happy to get to meet you. Same. And um, I'm excited for y'all. I'm. I love that I have another contact person to share with my clients yes. because cleaning and power washing and organizing, those are things everybody needs. Absolutely. At some point, right? Yes. So. Yes, ma'am. And we were, we just want to thank you too. Yes. And now we have you also right. on our roster. Yes. So. Yes. Okay. Thanks, Kim. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you guys so much. <laughs>